headed down to the Arches and Canyonlands National Park. Let's see what's popular on Moab with Rachel Moody. Hi, Jay. Thanks for coming back down to Moab with me. I'm bringing you to a cool five-acre parcel on Easy Street. Easy Street, that's a great name. You know what's funny? When I go to look at real estate, I always look at the name because I would never buy a house on a bad name. Yes, Easy Street is just a local favorite. It's right next to Heaven. Um, there's a street right next to it called Heaven Street. There's Heaven and Easy, right, in the same All-American Acres. Um, that's that's a great idea. really cool part of town, yes. Yeah, it's got a lot of character. And as we go inside this house, you can see all the character in here. They Somebody has really loved this property. Yes, it is full of character. It is a charming little house. Um, lots of uh, light as well as this nice sunroom that she has here um, with her. It's adjoined to her kitchen and her dining room and an outdoor patio. Um, what's really, really unique about this home is that it sits on five acres. Um, and with that five acres, it is subdividable. If you wanted to do multiple things with that property, you could have just a five acre mini farm because it has a tremendous amount of water. It also has um, animal rights. So lots of opportunity for agriculture if that's something that you're interested in. Um, but it also has the ability to be subdivided into small parcels. Um, nothing less than one acre. So if somebody wanted to split off a couple of acres um, to make the home more affordable or to build another home, that would certainly be a potential here. And that's really nice because if you want the seclusion and be away from things, you just leave your acreage. If you want to make some money, you can subdivide, which is Absolutely. a lot of fun. Flexibility is always a good thing in real estate. I agree. I agree. And this one has so many options. It comes down to animals, agriculture. Um, if you want to do a shop, have a place for toys. If you want to build a large luxury home, this one's surrounded by some other luxury homes. Um, it has a lot of potential and it's really just in one of our classic favorite neighborhoods called All American Acres um, out in the valley. And it's got so much character. This is just teeming with character everywhere you look like oh my gosh this thing's yeah. so cool it is pretty cool yeah and a lot of acreage a lot of flexibility this, this is a good one i really like this 